Hi everyone, this is just a quick video uh, to address some specific questions that I've been getting on the import wizard. Uh, now some of you are having issues where when you uh, import your file from LDRAW you're getting an error message in the simulator saying that you have parts missing. Uh, if you're using a tool other than LEGO Digital Designer, so for example uh, LDCAD or MLCAD, it might be the case uh, that your uh, LDRAW installation in the, uh, in the sim is not pathed correctly. So I'm going to show you today is how to solve that problem. What I have here is I'm using a different CAD tool uh, than the one I normally use. It's called LDCAD. I, I quite like it. And I'm just going to search uh, for a part here. And in this particular case, this part uh, was not coming in. So I'm going to search for 3708. And in both cases here, you can see that I have um, uh, 3708.dat and this 3708.26. And I'm just going to drag them both onto my scene. Uh, earlier on, um, I was getting an error message saying that these parts were not able to be found in the sim. So I'm just going to try and re-import them again. I'm going to make a couple of small changes. So I have these parts here. I'm going to save my file. So I'm going to go save as. And I'm just going to call this... Uh, test. It's fine. Put it on my desktop. I'm going to come back here into the simulator. And what I'm going to do here is I'm going to imp I'm going to first off make sure that uh, my preference my preferences are set to find my Eldra installation. So I'm going to go to file preferences. I'm going to go and scroll down here to the paths tab. And here what I want to make sure is that the simulator can find my Eldra uh, installation, which it can. Uh, so I'm just going to click the browse and in this particular case, uh, usually from experience, uh, let's just see here, the Eldra installation can be found in C, Users, Public, uh, public Documents. Here it just says Documents. And here's my Eldra installation. I'll just have the uh, browse look here at the, uh, at the parent folder. And I'll hit OK. And OK again. And that should do it. So if you're not using LEGO Digital Designer, that's one way to make sure that the sim knows where your LDRAW installation is. If you are using LEGO Digital Designer, you can come up here and go help patch LEGO Digital Designer, and that should do the same thing. Uh, so let's just round this out here. I'm going to go into my import wizard and bring in my blocks. So let's go here and find test. You can see that it finds uh, both of the axles. Hit next. It doesn't matter what name I give them. And uh, the assignment of uh, physical properties to the axle is complete. So I'm going to click here on my objects list, find my axles, and they're underneath my mat. Here they are. When I hit play now, because uh, we've assigned physical properties to the two axles, they should fall to the ground. So I'll hit play, and they do. So uh, that's uh, pathing Eldra in a nutshell. If you have any questions at all, just let us know. Send us an email at support at cogmation.com. Take care.